everyone, welcome to Happily Organized Chaos. I'm Jen, and for today's video, I'm going to do a home decor tag. Brittany from Bits of Paradise had posted a video yesterday on home decor, and she tagged it. So I thought it was interesting, and I really enjoyed watching her, so I thought I'd, maybe other people would like the scene, and I would give it a whirl. So, here we go. Number one, what would you consider your design style? Well, I'm definitely transitional. I, I enjoy pieces that are classic and elegant and stand the test of time, but I like a little contemporary flair, I guess, to them. Um, like, I really love, in my dining room, I have the farmhouse table and I have Parson chairs. Now these aren't my first choice, these were gifts, but I would, like, mixing the two, you know, the rustic and the elegant, or the rustic and the contemporary. Um, I love subway tile for a backsplash, that's classic, and it will stand the test of time. And the same with me too, as far as white cabinets go in the kitchen. Um, white cabinets, I don't feel that they'll ever go over style, and that's why, no matter what type of kitchen I do, we will always have white cabinets. Yes, they are a pain to clean, but they're classic, and I love them. Number two, what is your favorite and least favorite color to design with? I don't like orange. Um, I probably will never decorate with orange. I don't mind coral which is more of a pinkish tone. Um, but I really love the beachy blue, kind of tealish beachy blue. Um, you find that a lot in my house. Number three, what is your favorite store to shop at for furniture and decor? Where I live, we don't have a huge selection of stores that you may be familiar with. Um, there are a few furniture stores that I would shop at, but I can't, I don't want to name them because it, then it will be obvious um, to where I live. We do have a Target, and unfortunately it is closing, and that happens to be my favorite store. <laughs> it's so sad. Um, Target's Canada Wide decided that they were closing, and they're going to be going through the liquidation process in the next couple of weeks. and within four months they're going to be all gone and Starbucks already closed so yes I am a sad devastated girl but I love Target for any of their home decor and the furniture what I liked about the furniture was it was really high-end looking for a fraction of cost and so where you'd pay $179 for a chair at Target you'd find the same chair for like $3.99 at a furniture store. So, unfortunately it is what it is, right? Number four, what's a design tip you have? Definitely buy for your space. Um, don't try to squeeze in furniture that you already have in love into a space where it's not going to fit. A table that's too big in a dining room is going to make your room feel closed in and claustrophobic. Um, five. Who is your interior design crush? Hands down, no questions asked, Sarah Richardson. Um, she is Canadian, which is a yay. Um, and she, her style is exactly my style. Uh, there has not been one room that she has designed that I haven't loved. And I started watching Sarah when she started her first show, which was room service back in, I can't even remember, it was way back when, an alligator. And yeah, I just, I wish she could come to my house and completely decorate it. She is the one person I feel that I could give complete design control to, which is a lot for me saying because I make all the design, des, design, des, des, blah. Do I make all the design decisions Number in my six. Books. What is your favorite online store to shop for furniture and home decor? 
I love Pottery Burn, Pottery Burn kits for my children, Restoration Hardware, Valor Designs, West Elm. Yeah, I love them all. And Land of Nod for my kids as well. Um, I don't shop at them a lot, but I use their websites for inspiration. Um, there might be a few things that I'll buy here and there, but it's just because of the shipping costs, it, it works out to be too much. And number seven, what is the next item on your design to do list? We have a few. We have a, a really long line, a really long list. Um, we want to do the kitchen. There's a wall between the kitchen and the dining room. We want to take that down. There's a wall between what used to be the playroom before we moved down to the basement and our living space upstairs, I guess, living room. We want to take a wall down there. And we want to fix up my daughter's closet, which is probably the next thing that will be accomplished because it is the least expensive and it is relatively simple. Just a little bit of paint and some bookshelves and a little like a bean bay kind of reading area and then a rod to hang some of her dresses. Um, she's only three, so her clothes are still short. <laughs> and uh, so that was the end of the, the tape. I really am glad that you decided to stick around and watch it. Please leave comments below if you like this type of video or if you think that maybe home, uh, home decor videos would be something you're interested in. I'll link Britain's channel, Bits of Paradise, in the description box below, as well as any of the other stores that I mentioned in my video. So that's it for now. Um, thanks for watching Happily Organized Chaos, and I'll see you later. Bye-bye.